I was born 400 years ago in the Highlands of Scotland. I am immortal, and I am not alone. Now is the time of the gathering, when the stroke of a sword will release the power of the quickening. In the end, there can be only one. Here we are, born to be kings. We're the princes of the Cloud? Why can't you live in an apartment like everybody else? Fitzcairn? Oh, excuse me. I hope that sword isn't for me. It is if you keep staring. Hey! Oh, forgive me, my lady. That's Tessa. Hugh Fitzcairn. I was so taken with your loveliness. Well... Thank you, kind sir. Kind and brave. Did Duncan ever tell you about the time oh, when we... I'm sure you will, so why don't you go uh, on deck and I'll meet you up there in a second. That's Fitz. Mead. The honeyed nectar of the gods. <laughs> Haven't tasted this since King Richard's day. Where on earth do you find it? Darius brews it himself. Oh, brother Darius. Well, he hasn't lost his brewmaster's touch. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I still can't imagine an immortal as a priest. I mean, the religion I can understand, but giving up women? <laughs> Has the man gone completely mad? <laughs> so what brings you here? Yeah. Well... Some friends, all immortals, have recently gone missing. Well, it's the time of the gathering. One immortal goes missing. Granted, it could be one of us took his head. But three? Where did they go? What happened to the bodies? You spoke to all of them recently? Yeah, except Thackeray. We were due to meet in Dublin on the day he disappeared. He, he said he had something to show me, something he'd never seen before. You know, that's, that's strange. I spoke to Darius the other day. He said he had a dream about Thackeray. Don't tell me he still thinks he's having dreams that foretell the future. Oh, it's probably a throwback from his misspent youth. <laughs> Did he say what it was about? No, oh, this and that. It was mainly about his death.
Feeling. He's not here. He's always here. Tremendous fight. Yes. The world would truly be a darker place without you, my friend. I didn't believe his premonition. I just didn't... never thought he'd. No one's to know what happened here. The police. They won't do anything about him being missing for a couple of days. Once I've dealt with whoever killed him. Well, once we've dealt with whoever. Okay, once we've dealt with whoever killed him, we'll give him a decent funeral. You know, this doesn't make any sense. This is holy ground. No immortal will come here. Somebody did. You can't believe he's gone. Yes, he'll be sadly missed. He was one of the best of us. I made some notes of my conversations with Thackeray. They're back at the hotel. They're not much, but... It's a start. I'm so sorry, Duncan. Do you have any idea who? No. Yo, my friend! It's happening. Oh, company. Hi, it's nice to meet you. I'm Richie. If it's Ken. Pleasure. <laughs> you are not going to believe what happened to me today. What's going on here? What's with all the long faces? What happened? Somebody die? It's a story. I'm sorry. Look, is there something I can do? Let me, let me do something. Help you. Your intentions are most honorable, young man. This is best left to Duncan and myself. All right, okay. It's, uh, it's your situation. I never thought one of the good guys would lose. You know, if mortals did kill Darius, do you not think it's a bit of a coincidence that they beheaded him? Unless they know about us. Now, that is a troubling thought. This is his gun. Is you?
There's a ship for England sails at dawn. We should be aboard. You worry too much, my friend. Actually, I think we should stay for at least another two days. Cloud, this is serious. <laughs> Our service to the Duke de Milano is finished. Our work is done. But he's still in danger. We've brought him here safely. Oh, I see. Is it the Duke you're worried about or his daughter? <laughs> Twice I've intercepted poison meant for him. Tis as well you have a cast iron stomach, my friend. Well, as they say, it runs in the family. Aye. <laughs> but if we stay, it's only a matter of time before his enemies come looking for us. Nice pipes. My instinct tells me we should leave. Since when have you been bothered by a good fight? Oh, it's not the fight I hate. It's the waiting for it. Get to the Duke. <laughs> Seems my instinct was right. We should never have split up. I can't believe I fell for that, Tessa. It's the age-old rule, divide and conquer. Maybe they're working for some government. Yeah, well, that doesn't explain the tattoo. Damn, I can't find that symbol anywhere. That man chose to die instead of talking to you. Mac, I'm scared. Well, you should be. Maybe they're working for an immortal. Yeah, maybe. No, that can't happen. Darius was in a church. 
Even the most evil of us wouldn't desecrate holy ground. It looked as if they were searching for something at the rectory. What? I don't know. If Darius knew what it was about, wouldn't he have told you? Back to the rectory. Mac, I've been thinking about this. Fitzcarran had meetings with three other immortals and they all disappeared, right? Maybe he led them to Thackeray without meaning to. Right, Fitzcarran came here. He didn't go to Darius. Why didn't they just go after him? They did. Oh, man, what's... Look, I don't have time to explain, all right? I think the answer's back at the rectory. Take it easy, all right? Okay. Look, okay, I have to test it for me. I will. Mac, there's one thing I don't get, though. If these guys are just regular human beings and they can't sense you immortals, how do they know when they found one? Oh, this isn't some more of your moss stuff, is no, it? No, no, no. I don't trust you. You sure it's not? It's from a mold form. <laughs> some more? No, no, no. <laughs> I'm a cloud. I am Darius. You won't need that. You shouldn't be taking part in this tragedy. I was raised a warrior. I choose battles I believe to be just. Oh, I'm sure. You're quite loyal to your convictions and compatriots. But I wonder what these men think about that, about convictions and compatriotism now. today. Mm. Are you ready for a game? Or are you afraid I'll finally beat you? What's the matter? Sometimes being a Catholic priest is easier than other times. Anything you want to talk about? Would that I could, my friend, would that I could. No. It's our game. I won't press. If there's anything you need. Yes, I know, but some things must remain unsaid. Okay, so whose move is it? It's yours. Are you sure? Yes, but good move now.
new. Where's your hand? Let me take a look at that. Wait, it's just a cut. No, no, I'm a doctor. I insist. Oh. I'm sorry, I've, I've made it bleed again. Still, it looks quite healthy. You should be careful. Infections can lead to all kinds of nasty things. was one of them, wasn't he? He wanted to know if you were an immortal. If you were, you would have healed more quickly. But what if I was? They must have been following me all day and I didn't see them. I think you only see these people when they want you to. Who's Richie? At the antique dealer, Rue de Moineau. I wanted to go, but he insisted. Why? Lock this place up tight and don't let anybody in. Anybody!
Why don't you come back? Well, Mac, I'd, uh, I'd like to say I sense you were in danger, but the truth is there's this really cute blonde who works in the antique store. All right, I never thought I'd be thankful for your libido. <laughs> Dungeons and Dragons. Hello? You killed Darius, and you took Thackeray and the others. What do you want? I know my countenance is pleasurable to the eye, but can't we discuss this? You'll find me a friendly sort of chap when you get to know me. Damn you! <laughs> Remove the arrow. Anton, make sure he's dead. Then we'll see if he's truly immortal. This book holds the key to what's going on. Darius put my clan colors on it so that I'd find it. What's it say? Well, I'm not certain, but most pages have been destroyed in some kind of fire. The ones left are handwritten in an ancient German. But you speak German. This is primitive Teutonic well before my time. It's a book on some kind of mythology. What kind of mythology? It speaks of uh, battles, gods, and immortality. It's a book about you guys? Written hundreds of years ago? What should we do? Well, I have to spend a little more time with this book. You want me to do something? Yeah, hold down the fort. All right. No company? No thanks, Rich. What's it like for him, Tess? What do you mean? To have a friend for 200 years and then... I don't know. So... You are one of them. You weren't sure, were you? It was a test. What if I'd been mortal? You'd have murdered an innocent man, you ruthless bastard. Where's the book? Who are you working for? On the bus. Is that your game? How much is he paying you? Where's the book? Book? What book? The Fifth Chronicle. Fifth Chronicle? What, what are you talking about? Don't lie to me. We know Darius had it. Do I look like a fellow who's in any position to lie? You know, you really should do something about that temper of yours. Because one of these days is going to get you into terrible trouble. I've often wondered how much pain an immortal could bear. Before he went... mad.
Let's go! Oh, yeah, like a, uh, like a sword is a standard issue for home protection. Where's Tessa? She's down below. Let's get inside. It's a book of observations on who we are, what we do. So it's like a history book? Whoever wrote it was a historian, yeah. The secretary to a secret order of men who observed us but did nothing to interfere. That's why we didn't know about them. Mac, we gotta do something. They cannot just kill Darius and walk. We are doing something. What are we doing? It seems like we're just sitting here. It seems like we're doing nothing. We're waiting. What are we waiting for? These men leave nothing to chance. They observe before they strike. Okay? Yeah, I'm fine. You don't have to be. Tessa is dead and there's nothing I can do to bring him back. What else is there to say? You don't have to say anything. I just want you to let yourself more. I bury more friends than I can count, Tess. Death is part of my life. Not his death. He was so wise. Told me so much. He wasn't supposed to die. He was on holy ground, Tess. He should have been safe. He should have been safe. Come on. Oh, oh, man, oh, it's always people and their dogs, I can't believe, you believe this again, again, oh, it always happens to me, oh, this is disgusting, always, all the time, get this stuff off, maybe you got a Kleenex or something, can you believe this again? Nothing in the car. 
move the barge. We have won a great victory. We have destroyed a malignant evil that has walked this earth in the form of a man for the last 2,000 years. People do not cheer us. People do not even know we exist. But we know the battle we fight. We know the evil we must destroy. I would like to send you back to your homes, to your lives. But our work here is not finished. Bring him. Ah, come to play some more. Hmm? Oh, it's about time you good fellows came to your senses. I'm sure we can come to some amicable arrangement. Take me to your master. If you can get the buck off. <laughs> and don't be so aggressive. Please be careful with my jacket. Just a minute! This, this is madness! There are no emotions here! All I have will be wasted! What do you want? All I know will be lost! There will be no quickening. What do you want? Your man! Mistake. I've been friends to generations of men. Your grandfathers, your great grandfathers. I've slain tyrants who would have made slaves of your enemies. You ungrateful encephalopods. You are an abomination before nature and in the eyes of man. There is no glory but ours, no destiny that is not of our making. Uh oh. Time to go! It's been a grand romp. Oh, the stories I could tell you, lads. I don't suppose you've got time to listen. Do I get a last request? No. And you call yourself human? What is it? A last smoke of my pipe. I don't think so.
that how you killed Darius? I'm unarmed. You hate us, but you expect us to behave honorably. Why is that? When you kill me, others will come to continue what we have begun. <laughs> I'm not your enemy. This isn't about mortals. We have our own fight, don't you understand? We've always understood. We will never be dominated. <laughs> <laughs> Liar! We know about the gathering. Do you sense evil in me? Talk to me! Tell me what you know! It's about power. There is nothing greater than the power of man. Nothing. Women of the world will thank you, my friend. Where's Richie? I think Doris would want him to be here. He knows. He'll be right in. I know you'll never have another friend like Darius. I'm sorry. I'll find him one day. They'll find me. Fifteen hundred years ago, you led an army of barbarians to the gates of Paris. You dismantled your army and spared the city. Broke a promise to yourself. You march west from the Ural Mountains until you'd reach the sea. Go where you never went. 